dynamic table and then create a VS Lambda function, store data in the dynamic DB table using the VS Lambda function. This is how it's going to look like these two. And then we need to create a new Dynamo table called vehicles with the primary partition key ID string. Modify your Lambda function to reference the vehicles table. Create new app gateway resource for vehicles. Create a post method with Lambda proxy integration and deploy the API. So let's start practicing. So now we are in AWS console. Let's go to DynamoDB and create a table. Click on create table. Locations and partition key will be ID. Um, customize settings. This will be default and create the table. Wait until it's active and let's go to Lambda now. We are going to create Lambda function, uh, lab function. This will be Python 3.10. Change default execution row. Use existing and this will lab function row and create function. Scroll down to the code. We are going to delete this code and I'm going to add the one that we just downloaded and I open it in here. So I'm just copy. I'm just going to copy this one. Let me make sure that I'm copying it correctly take all of it don't miss any lines and spaces let's deploy this code now we are going to uh, example JSON this one um, let's copy this code and go to test event name location this will be private J format JSON on First, we need to replace it here and format JSON. Okay, and save. Now let's click on test again. And response available true ID one reserve yes. So we just need to review this one. Function logs. Now let's go to DynamoDB and see our created table it is still not showing so we are going to wait uh, okay so now it's active and go to locations export table items this is the one that created by lambda function and now we are going to go to epic gateway Let's go down, deploy RESTful API, this one, click on build, okay, REST, new API, this will be DRI API, and create API, um, so this is the validation. Um, what we need to create now create new dynamo db table called vehicles with the primary partition key id string modify your lambda function to reference the vehicles table create new epic get gateway resource for vehicles create post method with lambda proxy integration um, deploy the epi and this is the validation I, I just took the validation. I'm going to take this one as well so I can understand the steps what I need to do. Okay. I copied this part so it doesn't okay I will just take a picture of that so I can remember what I need to do. Let's first I need invoke URL epic gateway invoke URL and dynamo DB tables which will be vehicles. Okay, let's go start with DynamoDB table. I'm going to open it in another um, page. 
let's go to dynamo db create a table vehicles partition key will be id let's double check that vehicle without s id um, okay string sort key optional and now create the table let's go and change the lambda table now lambda function sorry this is the one we created um let's close that so it needs to let reference vehicles now let me see where i'm going to see the code from here better i think locations table name locations table so There is only one location, so I'm going to change that to vehicle 18. Was it here somewhere? On the top, here. Locations. Vehicle. Table name vehicle. Um, so now we need to test the ID, let me see where it was, somewhere here, a vehicle, mm. that was the previous test I think, shall we take that, copy that, um, ah, we haven't deployed yet, let's deploy, test, location, event type is location, let's configure a new Test event vehicle uh, vehicle vehicle ID mm. okay table scooter we can now let's go to other page that we have let's go to the gateway uh, and close this one we are going to create another epi rest epi build new epi rest epi let's say vehicles vehicle epi and create so we need the post action here mm, create method um, post okay lambda function uh, lambda function was lab function okay and save you are about to invoke okay this is the test let me see now what we need to type gateway invoke url this is not the url let's check uh, if there is anything missing but this is not the url we need to find the url here provide the url check the url and try again let's see deploy the epi we haven't deployed the epi i think um, actions deploy epi deployment stage new stage stage name and deploy 
so we have the URL number now URL name and let's delete that and validate yes uh, that's all done uh, I hope you enjoyed it I will see you in my next practice bye I can compete cause you're